Hey folks, Quill18 here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Stellaris! And this time we've got a mouse right from the start of the episode. God damn it. Kinda of bitter about that, sorry about that. Um, do we have any, like, high level scientists? Yeah, and you're still slowly heading over here, right? No. You're supposed to be here doing research projects. Thank you. I think, I think we're, we're, we're in good shape. So we're, we're continuing to just develop in this space here. Still kind of bitter that we got cut off over here. But at least we got a couple of high quality planets here. This planet was never going to be high quality. So it wasn't about losing the planet. It's just annoying that we can't reach these guys. But that's okay. So we're going to keep filling in here. Luckily these guys. Is this another fanatical purifiers? So we got two fallen empires right next to one another. And me feeling a little bit nervous. If these purifiers decide that I need purification, and I am right on their goddamn border. Um, have I made a terrible mistake? Xenofilth. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, we got our flagella. So we're not going to get any engineering for a while because we're doing the flesh's week at... Whoop, oh, stop, stop, stop. Everything stop. Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, plus one civic slots. Oh, the next capital. Cheaper war demands. Um, no, we're going to go for this. It's going to take a while, but that's going to be okay. Loop Temple. All right, so yes, we're still, we're on that event, the like worm something something from this black hole. Our scientists have learned a great deal about the subterranean temple, which remember we found under a capital. Uh, but some questions remain. A roof aperture along with the radial altar suggest it was once a solar calendar, but it's so badly damaged by the earthquake that we can't be certain. Uh, if the builders found particular dates important, we'll never know which ones. We've had better luck with the quote-unquote unknown alphabet. It's a D-based variant of a better-known hieratic script, not an alien language at all, and we successfully deciphered it. The temple is dedicated to the Waiting Worm, or the Worm in Waiting. Most of the inscriptions are sonorous, poetic invocations requesting its appearance, or, if read in the other direction, its departure. There's also a body of inscriptions describing the operations of the universe, which our most excitable archaeologist swears contains references to advanced field equations. Nothing new to us, but very impressive for a temple of this vintage. We have yet to find a physicist who is prepared to go on record as agreeing that the references are meaningful, though. The temple holds no cosmic secrets or alien weapons, as far as we can tell, but its dark spaces have a distinctive, menacing beauty, and the poetry of the invocations to the worm in waiting becomes fashionable. They are set to popular music. They are published in collections. So we can open the temple to the public something from our past what was w will be loop temple visitor center modifier added given the following effects five percent happiness i don't know if that's just on the current planet also unlocks a new research option strange loop and gives 20 percent progress towards it or ah, okay so i okay the both these options give me the strange loop this gives me happiness this gives me society research i want the happiness something's wrong here show leadership by sealing the fortress no Open the loop temple to the public. We're fully committing to this. Whatever the hell this is. Oh, the messenger. What was, will be. The ISS, that's our science ship, I think, Truck Rule, has located a small, minimally powered artificial object broadcasting a looping signal at local range only. Oh, spiraling pod. Um... These sorts of things usually turn out to be escape pods, and this looks like one of those. It's been out for a long time. When the crew cracks it open, carefully observing quarantine procedures, they find ancient remains preserved by the sterile pod's environment. So far, not unusual. The captain of the ISS truck rule indicates, however, that they did not expect to find the bureaucratic words, what was, will be, what will be, was, daubed, <coughs> excuse me, daubed on the wall of the bodily fluids of the pod's occupant. Ooh written in blood, who the crew are now wryly referring to as the messenger. They add that there are some equally unexpected anatomical similarities between the messenger species and our own. Issue special project. Man, oh man, this is getting... Okay, level two scientists. Spiraling plod. Plod? Yes, plod. Um, that's that's over here, right? No, wait. Oh. This, is some, this is somewhere completely different. It is in the Talmeric... Black hole, which is, oh, over here. Okay. So I don't know who's, like, the closest. I don't think we've got any science ships nearby, actually. We're going to send you. Congratulations. You have been elected to go to the black hole, which I can no longer find. Right here. Nope, not that one. 
Wait, what the f <sighs> Seriously, go to... Oh, this leads to the Taumeric Black Hole. This is the Zoad system. Okay, I kept seeing... Because it's not labeled in here. Sorry, my bad. Um, you are going here and researching that. How did you get over here? Hmm. Surveyed. Spaceport's done. Build me another battleship and another cruiser. Uh, you are... Go upgrade. So that we'll get our destroyers now. Um, so that they can <coughs> shoot down missiles that are going after other ships. I mean, it's possible we won't need that many missile countermeasures, but... I don't know, seems relatively safe. So everyone's busy, everyone's doing that. Our planets are sitting a little bit more idle here. And I should probably... Fleet Academy. Oh, so that's not a ground thing. That's... Oh, yeah, that's good. These four, first four planets are where we're going to be building most of these ships. It's quite expensive. Um, but it's probably worth doing. And a few more of these. Get some higher quality ships going on. Uh, oh, I would have liked to read on that. I guess I should take a look here. Um, just look at normal empires. Sort by who likes me. And research agreement. Research agreement. Here, let's max it out and we'll offer them some energy credits. There you go. Boop. Next, we're going to talk to these guys. Um, maybe we want a defensive pact. You know what? Yeah, we're not looking to war right now. Oh, right, the influence. Shit, I keep forgetting that. Never mind. No, we do definitely need it sweetened. I mean, you won't say no, but... There it is. Boom. Done. I and mean, that's probably going to cover a lot of it, but maybe we can get these guys. Uh, i tell you what, we'll not aggression pact with you. We'll get a migration treaty. Sure, it's fine. Research treatment, because we can still get a decent amount of stuff. Yeah, ooh. More valuable for them, so they'll offer me something. Um, just give me a bunch of minerals, actually. Instant transfer. There we go. Now, a lot, there might be a lot of overlap between those uh, research... Oh, I forgot to change the, the, the duration. That's okay. Um, there might be a lot of overlap, so we might not be getting as much of a bonus as we'd like, because I don't think the 25% stacks. So a lot of them probably have the same thing. Archaeological tech completed. We got an artifact. Excellent. Um, I just don't know if we're going to keep this sector or not. I guess we'll build the research stations for now. It doesn't cost us that much to build it. It's going to be okay. And I know you've, you're probably going around building things. Let's just get that accelerated a little bit. And then after that, you can come back over here and build some mining stations. Let's get all these mining stations set up over here. Okay. Science ship. Do we have anything to send you out? Well, we've got someone going out to study the messenger, so that's going to be okay. The specimen procurement, it's still all over the place. It's going to be kind of annoying. So yeah, just go and auto-explore. And auto-explore. I think we've got something going to this planet. This one here, it's got a fair amount of tech, actually. That's going to be a really nice addition. And it's continental, so we're going to send our own people over here. We'll just drop you over there. That's going to be fine. Can add you to the sector. Yeah, good. Good addition to more tech. Claim some more territory over here to build some uh, improvements that are going to be very valuable. Construction ship over here is done. I guess um, I'm going to focus on things that aren't in a sector quite yet, although some of these things are going to be absorbed into a sector soon. Oh, you're actually out of my border range. So is the black hole, although I suspect this stuff will grow at some point. Tell you what, let's go ahead and get the engineering stations up and running ASAP. Because again, we're trying to power through the Flesh's Week as quickly as possible, because it's really putting a, a freeze on our on our research here. Not in a bad way. Sector's missing resources. Oh, you are indeed losing cash. Let's give you lots of money for a little while. I suppose I can change this meter. Well, you're just not making any money right now, so... 
And I'm going to get you to increase this a little bit. So you can build a few more things. Hopefully things that make money, but, you know, whatever. It's a newer sector. You need a lot of minerals to get started. It's going to be fine. Really, there's nothing left for you to auto-explore. Wow. I guess you're going to start doing some assist research then. Now... Where's our central? Here's headquarters. I don't think I can just... Oh, we don't need a ship. Oh, that's interesting that way it lists it there. Um, so we're going to send you. I know you're not super high level, but that's okay. You're going to go here. Do we not have assist research? Oh, there it is. Thank you. Do that. Colonization in progress. Colonization in progress. Excellent. You've got some going there. No planets over here. I mean, we can get this, but it doesn't really help. 65% is not bad, but it's only size 10 planets, so it's not really worthwhile. Still got to take care of this bad boy. Ah, the messenger! Possibilities. We've established that the escape pod was the kind of commercially available knockoff common in the previous phase of galactic civilization. No new technologies or insights. The remains of the messenger, however, are another matter. It's unmistakably an ancestor or a variant of the bureaucratic species. Perhaps we have cousins out there, or perhaps we were subject to genetic manipulation by a precursor race. Manak Toros is requesting permission to conduct more extensive research. We can release the funding, or no. no of course, just keep going. Study the messenger connection. Absolutely. Why would we stop that? 60 days. Ooh, more rugged and perhaps more aggressive form of our previous species. Um, so you're done too, then. You are indeed done. So, if I look at my planets and sort by... Can I sort by, like, physics or something? Cafeteria's got a fair amount of tech, so let's go to ca cafeteria. And you are going to assist research over here. Mm -hmm. We could disband some of the science ships, too. Oh, the messenger leashed. Manic Tauros has reconstructed the messenger. It's uh, quite impressive, worryingly so. It seems to be considerably more robust and aggressive than our current edition. There is some confusion as to whether we were the source species and the messenger the modified version, or whether the messenger was our ancestor. Manic Tauros is firmly in the former opinion that we were once much more more of a warrior species, and that some meddling precursor muzzled us genetically. Indeed, they consider the loss of our martial abilities a tragedy. Such a tragedy that they have undergone a retroviral treatment to alter their own physiology to that of the messengers. They insist that this will equip them much better to continue the project. A creative form of treason. Execute them, please. So that would kill the scientist and give us more progress towards Strange Loop. Or... A creative form of treason, execute them, please, destroy their note, just kill them, or excellent idea, get on with it. Alright, let's do it! Oops, come on, click. Almost misclicked on the wrong thing there. That would have been an instant, like, Alt-F4, restart the episode. Because <laughs> I want to see where this is going, and I'm going to encourage my text to do it. So the foundlings, you're done as well. Hmm. Uh, not quite as techy. What about some of these other planets? IT department's pretty damn techy. Alright, IT department. Go to you. Send this ship and go and assist research there. I think we might trash one of our science ships at this point. Because we got that one back. We built two in response to losing one and we got one back. I think the next time someone like is done doing scouting, that's probably exactly what's going to happen. You're coming out. We're at 7 of 9 over here. You're going to expand over here. Seismic disturbances. There have many reports of unexpectable seismic disturbances on Kraz Prime. Tremors can be felt across the moon. It's a high gravity planet. Uh, many of our settlements have suffered damage. While investigating the earthquakes, our scientists discovered a vast network of subterranean caverns. The deepest of these caverns are home. Oh, the indigenous creatures that are down there. Situation log updated. We can. Stop, 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 stop. We can establish communications or preemptive strike. We'll establish communications. I mean, we're pacifists, right? Or something. Now, I think there's one route here that could result in them attacking us. So we're going to... Recruit some robots over here. 
are some defensive things. Robots are a little bit more expensive. Just in case anything weird should happen. Special project completed. One of our probes burrowed through the ground and intercepted the tunneling aliens from Crime Cry's Prime. After the startled alien workers calmed down, the probe was successful in establishing communications with their leaders. Uh, tell them, yeah, we wish to coexist in peace. 10% more society import, input. Output. One of those. Okay. Things can still happen there. If I recall correctly. Still want to take care of this thing. I just don't know how dangerous this enigmatic fortress will be. I mean, we might try to get our way up to the max um, naval capacity and just go to town. Ooh, and more tradition available. So, this unlocks the Paradise Dome. Growing ethics. What does this lead? When in defensive war with another empire, ship build speed is increased by 33%. Fire rate. Um, yeah. I mean, we do have to keep going down here. We could start a new one, but that seems a little, a little crazy. I do still like Prosperity, because it's got some pretty decent stuff in here. Eh. Eh. Get more unity from it. Yeah, alright, let's unlock the Pleasure Dome. Whether or not we build it, we'll see. But we should take a look at our planets here. Upgrade. Upgrade. You're not currently operating. We don't need more energy right now. I'm just going to look for things that this will upgrade you. Not that you're being worked right now. You've got an excess of food, though. Like You can move over there. That's fine. Science building here. We're going to keep going with uh, engineering because, well, it's about the same. Whatever. Go and build the engineering, though. That's fine. You definitely need some loving. Ten pops to the next level. Okay, that's fine. Um, a few more robots. Yeah, probably here. Droid. And... Mining network. And I mean... Oh, then we're out of resources. We'll probably keep building food on the places which have got it. The waiting world. Uh, oh, this is, this is back at my capital. No, this is Zelda Prime. This appears to not be the first Quillian settlement on this planet. A number of facilities and residences have been carefully mothballed, and with a little restoration, uh, will serve our new colony well, but all records have been erased. Possibly this is a smuggler's port or a haven for political exiles. Oh! So we can spend some minerals. Too good to be true. No, no, let's just do it. It's fine. Spiral hewn mine. Loop plowed farm. Oh my god! It's, yeah, it's not smugglers. It's our weird, like, galactic loop thing. Oh, we have a scientist over here that has passed. Then you know what? I'm just going to trash the ship. Disband. And we have an idle construction ship. We need more resources so that we can set these up, which we're going to do. Uh, that's timed out. That's fine. Oh, messenger. Okay, build mining stations over here. Monoctoros has now recreated the generic heritage of the messenger species. So, do we actually have, um, species, species over here in our empire? Not yet. Um, without stopping to ask anyone's opinion, they have also created a highly contagious retroviolet agent. It stalks our worlds under its influence. Our primal species falls into a chrysalis coma and emerges a day later as the messenger species. This is causing, it is fair to say, some excitement. This has gone too far. We end it now. Control the outbreak. All pops in the capital will be converted, but there it will end. Or this will transform our entire species. I mean, so we can have a mixed species. That's perfectly fine. And then we can choose how to spread it. So more bigger, more warlike. It hasn't said anything about us being more stupid or anything, right? You know what? What was shall be. We will change. Bring me a sample of the agent. There we go. Oh, first of all, did we just get the intelligence trait? I think we just gained the intelligence trait. And I think our species looks different. Minus two points remaining. Oh, you know what we never got around to is living standards, because we got the chemical ones. Chemical bliss. Consumer goods use plus three. So we need a lot more consumer goods. 
Oh, but happy but useless. No, that's not what we want. Right. Okay. I think we're going to go ahead and increase our happiness, though. We're going to do that. And you know what? We're going to do that with the Sabin as well. Congratulations. We're all going to go up to... Um, okay, so you're right. Because you're impoverished because you were unhappy. Let me verify that they're no longer, like, chronically unhappy. Right? Because of the recently conquered. Annex 2. Yeah, you're, you're fine. You've still got the impoverished and things, but that's okay. So, yeah, we are going to set your... Um, sorry, where were living standards to social... No, no, no. Social welfare. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. So we're going to have a lot fewer minerals now because of our consumer goods. But maybe it'll balance out. What else? You know what? Let's give them full citizenship now. That's going to be fine. Um, full military service. Colonization is allowed. No population controls. No migration controls. There you go. You are a full-fledged member of our empire here. I've been meaning to do for a while. Sorry it took me so long to get there. There we go. So, we definitely have lost a lot of mineral output. On the other hand, we should get a fair bit more tech because of the happiness. So we'll see. Now you guys are assisting research, assisting research. You guys are constructing. You're still moving to something for something. We are still doing the flesh is weak. So we've gone and uh, genetically modified ourselves, and then we're going to start using technology to do the same thing. Because why not? But yeah, our production rates tanking is a little bit painful. Maybe, maybe we can't do that. But there's still a lot of minerals that we can... I guess that's what we're going to focus on, actually, is... I was doing tech for a little while, but we're going to go and get all these minerals hooked up. And then soon we're going to worry about money, too, but that's going to be okay. It's going to be A-OK. -okay. Spiral fed hub. Maybe we can get a bunch of those, like, spiral fed and loop buildings and all that and really get um, a lot of fun stuff going on. So you guys have been upgraded. Excellent. You're just going to keep chilling. We're not going to build any more uh, military ships, apparently, right now, because we have no production capabilities. Ah, the waiting world. Shadows in the walls. Our settlers... Oh, yeah, that's that's that planet, Zeldra Prime. Our settlers were initially happy to make use of the buildings on Zeldra Prime. Their existence jump-started the colony, but now they've grown nervous. There are rumors that the buildings may still have occupants or active security systems, although no evidence of either has been found. Some colonists insist enigmatically that there are shadows in the walls. Also, by the way, you should be working that building. You should be working that building. You should be working that building. I mean, we have way overkill on food, although they're going to grow real fast now, so I guess that's nice. Um, discourage the superstitions. The buildings represent years of effort. Why take the risk? Have them... No. Reduce... Have them knowledge. This will cause unhappiness. No, no. Discourage the superstition. It's fine. Everything's okay. Nothing to worry about here. Oh, yeah, your max happiness here is 45? Yeah, it is. So you're never going to be that happy anyway. Um, droid, droid, mine, uh, mine, we don't need the food, yep, that's fine, Boop. oh, and over here, you can go ahead and build the ch -ch -ch frontier clinic, grow faster, uh, substance abuser, oh well, colony new colony, and Vega Prime, Okay, we're still well within our limit. That's good. We could queue up a little bit of stuff early on. Construction complete. And we may as well get the farm here where we can. It's nice to see so much tech, though. You'll get the Frontier Clinic there. That's great. I think we're probably going to add you to this sector, though, so we don't have to babysit you. Yeah, that's exactly what we're going to do. So this, this Kahina sector is getting quite big. Oh, uh, well, actually, we're not going to be able to reach there because we don't have a contiguous connection of things. Uh, okay. Protecting independence, that's fine. We're not too concerned. Flesh is weak. We're working on it! We're working on it! What else are we teching up right now? Oh yeah, the Spiral Fed Power Hub. Yeah, this one actually does have the minus 5% happiness. But that's a lot of energy. I don't know. I don't think we can resist that. 
Oh, you want one of these dusts, of which we still have the extra one. Sure, you know, it's fine. Okay, the waiting world, too many. Interesting news from Zeldra Prime, where we found those abandoned buildings. The census shows too many settlers. Records on a new colony are always unreliable, but as far as we can tell, they have authentic citizens' IDs, and no one in the world has suggested that any that there are any mysterious strangers. But the birth rate must have been extraordinarily high, or we have unlicensed migration, or something. Somehow, the population is higher than we might reasonably expect. Destroy those buildings? No, investigate as best we can. Okay. I don't think it actually created new citizens. Do we even want robots over here? Yeah, I want robots on all my planets. It's right next to the singularity. I'm sure that's fine. Oh, uh, construction ships. Let's go and... Where are you? You're somewhere completely far away. Yeah, yeah. Um, right here. There's tons of minerals to be gotten. Let's go and get that going on here. All right, well, I guess this is another time to put in a stop. I don't know what's happening on this system. It's super duper creepy, and I love it. Thanks for watching, folks. See you next time.